All right, welcome back. We're going to continue on with our leaf green Nuzlocke. It's been a minute since we did this, but we are going to go ahead and do our rules roulette. Um, one of the handful of cards that I have left um, that I'm pulling is one that is called, um, it's basically called No, no Encounters. Um, just means that for this episode, I uh, have to forfeit um, any new places and any encounters I would get. Now, luckily, this is late game, and I do have a good amount of Pokemon in my box, so this, you know, it's kind of a moot point, but it, it does fall under our rules roulette, and, um, it will affect us, you know, there might be something we'll stumble upon, and I'll, I'll wish I had the, uh, the ability to catch it, but for now, we're just gonna move forward and try and get this plot line uh, figured out. Sorry about that, I don't think I had my lock on. There we go. Alrighty. Oh, there we go, perfect. Okay. So, uh, yeah, oh, missed a berry. Come on. No, come on, that... Tell me I'm crazy, that, that looks like a berry spot. Okay, that's right, I have somebody you can cut, so we can jump ahead of this. Spinach is helping us out. Uh, remember our level cap is uh, sitting at, I don't know, what was it, 50? Yeah, 50 for the last gym later. Um, obviously, we're not quite near that yet. Um, I couldn't catch Pidgeotto anyway because of Dupes Claws and because we have the No Encounters card going on. I think if I had gotten this card earlier in the game, I might have forfeited one encounter, but otherwise I would have stayed kind of where I was and just grinded or found something else to do. I honestly forgot this was this was an option. I might have to put a caveat on this one about like, you know, must you know move forward in the game if at all possible. So oh, there is an item down there and there's okay. Whatever. If we run into somebody we run we run into somebody. Things like Bell Sprout I can skip, plus again goops. The biggest one of the big things I wish they kinda would have done with this game is uh how do I get that item? Um on these islands, I wish they had I don't know, done something to change like the Pokemon you have access to, if that makes sense. You know, like, maybe somewhere on an island there's a Porygon, or more Scyther, or Pinsir, like, some, like, some cool heavy level bug Pokemon in this part would be cool. Um, you know, maybe one of the islands, like, all the horses you like to go to, or, you know, just little things I think would have been cooler. I like that they added this part, because a lot of times I felt like Gen 1, or the original Gen 1, it could be a really quick game, like game gameplay-wise, but them adding this didn't necessarily make it any better, so that was that was kind of disappointing. I will apologize now. I'm going to go ahead and go back and grab however I can to grab that item. I think I just, yeah, just jump here, which sucks, and then... I guess since there is water in this forest, maybe I could have gone after a uh, um, an encounter that way. Yeah, whatever. Oh, it was just a full heal. Okay, so we're just gonna have to run around again. I think if I can get through the story plot in this part, then I will maybe like train off camera, like grinding, and then pick it back up at the beginning of the gym. I think that's the, uh, that's the option. I do hope everyone's still enjoying the series. Um, I know it's been kind of a challenge with some of the gaps, and then hopefully if people are watching this later, they're like, what are you talking about? Um, but, uh, you know, I'm excited. I'm really ready for the next one. Um, and again, I'll, I'll announce that next one 
when uh, I'm not doing stuff. Uh, this is also dupes because I caught Slowbro in a previous episode not too long ago. Um, but yeah, the next series I think is going to be really cool. I hope it works out. I think it's going to be super challenging. Um, again, I'm not going to give anything away, but just previous history with with it tells me it's going to be a challenging um, a challenging series with a, a higher chance of, of failing, obviously. So uh, this series has been you know ch challenging at times, but for the most part. You know, I've, I've gotten into a comfortable zone, and as long as I'm careful and pay attention um, while I'm talking, which is, which is half the battle, um, then I think I'll, I'll get somewhere. Good experience, good experience. I think the move here is actually Thunderbolt, but I do know that Hypno obviously has really good special defense, so... Ooh, he's setting up on me. You cheeky little... little cheeker. Well, that was your chance, buddy. You should have uh, made some kind of mood. move at me. Boom! Nice. That or they could have put, like, because it's a later generational game and they added this chunk to the game, they should have made it, like, you can pick up, like, the choice band on this island, or, like, some sweet TM or something from, from the new gen, like, the new generation that it's set up on. It's kind of how I would have done it, but... It's fine. It's totally fine. Beware of wild, very loving Pokemon. Well, what do you know? A Hypno that's weaker than the one that I just battled showed up. That's cool. Oh, you would poison gas me. Cheeky little buddy. I hate that they teleport you right away, though, because it's just, uh, it's okay, it's fine. I got a meteorite, gave it to the dude. Gives me a moonstone. And that's kind of cool. Um, oh, I'm poisoned. Okay. I am poisoned, but I have a sh crap ton of uh, health. So, just go through here. Oh, I know I talked to these people already. Okay, um... Oh, big question. Is it, wasn't there a dude who wanted... He would, like, teach Pokemon moves?
Okay, he needs mushrooms, and I don't have any mushrooms, but I know there's a way you can farm them. Um, off camera, obviously, I'll, I'll give it a farm, uh, farming as well, so. All right, and remember any of these islands, um, you know, I forfeited my encounters on, um, although I did get slow bro on this island, so it's fine. And then, oh yeah, up here was, is there a waterfall? Yeah, why do they... Okay. Every freaking thing. Okay, so that's Island 2. No encounters. I mean, that slow bro at the end is one of the last things I'll potentially use. Like, um, if I get a chance, I think slow bro would be awesome for the team, but I also... That would probably mean I lost Lapras, and I don't want to lose uh, Taco, so. Alright, let's just talk to Bill, get this shenanigans done and figured out. Hello, my friend. Oh, hey, what kept you so long? Hey, man, I'm running around. No, no, do, do they make you, uh, yeah, they make you leave? That's so stupid. That's the other thing in this chunk, they make you do everything. Vermilion Port. And, and then, see, they put you where you can't even go back. It's kind of, it's completely annoying. Um, so yeah, I know I have Fly. Go ahead and take and go to Vermilion Port and go back. Um, you know, I only have a few minutes left on this rules roulette episode. Um, and I'm going to do grinding off screen. I'm going to keep the rule, though, um, of no new encounters. Um, so even though there'll be... Um, there's like a fire path and you know maybe I'll leave one of the things available but like here I'll show you guys I'm gonna go right over here and train like I'm just gonna go this Kindle Road bypass I'm gonna use the no new encounters and just uh and just gonna train that's um that's the main thing I'm gonna do because maybe I'll get to like 48 before I walk into the gym I think that'll be reasonable That'll give me some space if I need to get like a level or two on uh, one of my Pokemon while I'm going through the gym and I won't go over like, you know, the limit. But it'll, um, you know, it won't make me go crazy grinding against a bunch of like Pidgeotos and stuff. Because um, anyone that's played these games or is, is pretty familiar Definitely before Victory Road, very few places to train. Especially certain Pokemon of certain types. They're just not good places to train them. Um, obviously, when you get to Victory Road, you get a slightly better spot to train. But you still, like, the grinds can take forever. And since I'm doing this Nuzlocke, especially my first recorded uh, video recorded Nuzlocke, I don't want to just rush into it and completely screw myself up. Uh, so yeah, you know. Just kind of basics. I'm glad Pear got to got to level 46 here. Um, we'll go ahead and we'll throw uh, spinach and taco kind of up there. And uh, I'm gonna go ahead and save. Thanks everyone for watching. Like I said, I'm gonna do a little grind off screen. Uh, get us to maybe right before the gym or some something where some of this extra part that doesn't mean anything is gone. So thanks for watching. Catch you next time. Um, have a good one.